the purpose of the, the diversity and inclusion is to make sure that everybody understands that no matter your race, your male, female, your sexual preferences, you're somebody, you have a voice. I handle the uh, African American Special Emphasis Council. By the name, you would think it's all African Americans, but no, there's Caucasian, there's Hispanic, all in my council. The purpose of the Special Emphasis Council is to bring our culture awareness here within the Minnesota National Guard. By doing so, we go to uh, different events around the city. We've also gone outside of the state um, on one of our other councils, the Holocaust Remembrance Council. My favorite is every Christmas, along with the St. Paul Police Department, we have a group of airmen and soldiers. They bring, this past year, I believe it was 300 underprivileged kids who could not afford gifts for their families. What happens is they pair each of us with three shorties. We take them across the street to Target, let them shop for their parents. Then they come back, we feed them pizza and all that stuff and let them play games. And that's my favorite every year. Basically, each council is, is uh, set to bring awareness to the culture um, of its title. The Holocaust Remembrance, the LGBTQ, the Native American. I believe there's seven different councils right now, and we're still looking to add more. They're open to all ethnicities. Um, no matter what the title says, whichever council you want to join, more than welcome, we take you. When something happens that is negative in the news or something like that, we do speak about it. We talk, we get together, we discuss it. How, what are your feelings? Those types of things. It brings a lot of things to the air where you don't have to bottle it up and just walk around me mugging everybody this way. I mean, it's, it's out there. You have a nice discussion. And at the end of the day, everybody leaves on good terms. Success is going to be these new airmen and soldiers that we bring up from the bottom up. It's going to be up to them. The weight's going to be on their shoulders to carry this program into the next century. I mean, states are coming to us, asking us for advice on how to start their own DNI program. Reach out, come to an event. Our events are open to any and everybody. We're always happy to take more.